friend of mine came by. We'll call him Jerry. Well, it's because it is Jerry. But he came by and he was like saying, hey, there's this new poll that came out. It like basically showed, you know, wages of everybody. And like basically, you know, the Asians, they were on the top bracket. They were making 60,000. And then there was this wide gap below that. And there was the white people, you know. And then below that was the Latin people. And then, you know, below that was like, you know, the African-American people. You know what I'm saying? And so like, I thought about it for the second. I was like, wow. I go, but you know, check it out though. If we flip it and we just do the penis chart, you can see African-American people have now took the top of the chart. And voila, there's a large gap between everybody else and the Asians, once again. Just thought I'd point that out, because it's funnier than shit. No racial intent, sir, men out there, so anybody leave me racial comments, this is just funny shit. Jerry was saying, hey, on this chart, you know, we're the richest, so we just flipped the chart of the penis chart. So, hey, there you go. It's pretty damn funny. Let's jump in, let's do the unboxing of this new Z-Box from the people at Zotac. <laughs> Anyways, today we're going to do an unboxing of something that I think is actually a really cool product. A lot of people look for computers these days to put in weird places. So that's it. If you're looking for a computer to put in your kitchen, your bathroom, or anywhere where really space matters and you'd like to have something small, today we're going to take a look at something from Zotech. This is pretty cool. This is their Z-Box Nano. Now, what is a Z-Box Nano? Z-Box Nano is an all-in-one computer. It contains the AMD dual-core 1.6 gigahertz processor on there. This is part of their APU line. It's the smallest one they have. It also has 6310 graphics on it and supports full 1080p graphics. Now, is it a gaming platform? No, it's not really a gaming platform, but it will do all your things like surf the internet, check your email, you know, all the basic like things that you could use in your house beyond gaming which are actually mini lots of uses for one of these things all right so like every unboxing we're going to start out we're going to say the outside of the box this is the front you can see it's the zotac zbox plus nano your palm sized mini pc amd vision series features you can see two gigabytes of memory 320 gigabyte hard drive we'll actually open the thing up later and let you check it out i'm going to go ahead and flip it around real quick to show you guys the back of the box you guys see there's all kinds of connections Everything you want, display port, HDMI, everything but your old school DVI, which probably everybody's going to move past that anyway. And being mini size, that's a really good thing. Let's flip it around one more time right here. Here we're going to show you what comes inside the box. So this is basically the Zotac Z-Box Nano. This is the AD10 Plus, and these are all the specifications. The CPU is the AMD E350. This is their APU platform, meaning all-in-one technology. It has a dual-core 1.6 gigahertz processor. The chipset is the AMD M1, and we can see the graphics are the HD 6310. Here it talks about the expansion right here. Not a whole lot of expansion, but basically you can change the memory and you can change the hard drive out. That's pretty flexible. Have gigabyte LAN, including Bluetooth and Wi-Fi connectivity. All good. Comes with the remote, so you can click the thing from wherever you're at and do it. Comes with a card reader, so if you have your camera, all that type of stuff, you just take your card reader, plug it in there, and get all your stuff off there and work on it. Audio is actually onboard 8 channel, so you have digital audio onboard. This will be provided to the HDMI link as well as your monitor. So all in one connectivity there for that, which also goes to the display port. And here at the bottom, it tells you all the connectivity, HDMI, display port, my headphones, two USBs, two USB 3.0, two USB 2.0, RJ45 and eSATA are all there. So now I'm gonna pop the cap right here. Go ahead and open this up right here. Take the little lemon out, throw the box off to the side. See, it just pops open. Right off the bat, we can see there's the Zotac remote control. See the little Windows Media button there and all that. So this will operate everything on it. Pretty cool. I like having a remote. Let's see here. I'm going to go ahead and move the unit off to the side real quick and go ahead and see the rest of the stuff that comes in here, which will basically be the bundles page. So let's go ahead and look at all the stuff that are actually going to be the bundle. And that's not it. That's just the box. But what have we got here? Okay. Here we've got a mounting plate. Oh, I'm having trouble getting on here. It's stuck to the cardboard somehow. There we go. All right. This is your VESA wall plate. So if you want to mount this onto a wall or anything else, you just put this on there thing sticks onto it. If you have some other VESA wall mount, it'll do that as well. Here's all the power cable stuff. A little power brick. Your plug-in that goes into the wall. All that kind of stuff. Oh, including a little uh, thing here. This will be for your Wi-Fi. So this will help you get a stronger Wi-Fi connectivity. I'm not going to unbundle all these cables and set them all up there. It's too much stuff to do. 
flip it off the side. Here goes the Z-Box Nano, your palm size mini PC. This is your manual and all that stuff. Here's a little Z-Box Nano. This is the CD for putting all the drivers in and all that good stuff. And then we get to the heart of the matter. The first time that I saw this thing and I took it out, I said, wow, that thing's barely bigger than an Apple TV. And let's check this thing out. We'll start up here at the top. It's got my fingerprints all over it. I apologize for that. I've been handling this thing quite a bit. You can check that. It looks pretty cool. Here's the front. So here we see the front and we see here's the on button. Right here we have the infrared remote control. You can see everything, your card reader and both your headphones and your microphone connections all here in the front. Very easy to get to. Very small, thin unit. On the back, you can see there's all the latest connectors, eSATA, you got your Wi-Fi connectivity, your LAN, both Bluetooth, USB, and HDMI all are here on the back. So lots of little connections and a little thing that's basically the size of my palm. Actually, it's even smaller than my palm. Look, here's my palm. There's the unit. You can almost hide it. Now, to work on the unit, there's four little screws here. So I'm going to go ahead and start removing these folks so you guys can see what they are. So it says right here to pull. So basically, I'm going to pull this, and this opens the tab. Let me get this little thing out of here. It's actually really easy if you do it right the first time. So here you guys can see hard drive, 320 gigabyte. Inside you can see we use SDIM memory, SODIM, laptop memory stuff. So it's only upgradable via the one slot. So you could probably get a four gigabyte one in there. In fact, I may call over to Kingston and say, hey, brother, give me some memory. So easy to take apart, easy to upgrade, the size of your palm. I haven't actually got a price on this thing yet. I will try to get it and put it in the bottom of the video. So hey, check it out. We'll leave you guys at the end of the video just showing you guys a bunch of pictures of the product, how cool it looks. Thanks for watching. Today you saw the Zotac. This is the Z-Box Plus Nano PC all-in-one unit. Thanks for watching. See you guys back here on Tech of Tomorrow.